I think Nick does the best breakdown of the Franks motion here. And I think it's very important to look at. So we'll let Nick take away his Franks motion here. And this is Nick uh, explaining to himself the Franks motion. Power 287, show the difference, fuck face. What is the difference between the videos? Well, one says backwards internet on it. There, there's the difference. That's the only difference that matters because it's different. Objection! So Frank's challenge is just a challenge to any of those statements. It says they're a lie and says that that lie is material. Now, if they if they make some misrepresentation that has nothing to do with issuing a search warrant, then oh well. Hold it! That's not the question. The question is, why didn't the cop just not lie? So if you're stuck in the analysis of arguing over the over the quality of evidence, you're way in the wrong part of the trial. Objection! The idea is that that alone, like, they lied once, is not enough to overturn a warrant. They have to lie in material ways that are to the issuance of the warrant. And that's what the Frank's challenge is for. Hold it! Well, one says backwards internet on it. There. There's the difference. Objection! But did it, did it, if they change that, if they get rid of that line, does the search warrant still issue? If so, eh. Objection! You're not in the right spot. And I'm sorry that practicing lawyers have misled you into the wrong analysis by not being competent at what they talk about. But they have. They have misled you. They have let you down. They have done so to extract money from you. Now, yes. And before you guys go any further, this is by Third World YouTuber. Uh, just wanted to give him credit for what he did. It's a very, it's very well done. That was a very brilliant synopsis of everything that occurred. And it's funny because N red shirt Nick is correct. Blue shirt Nick is 100% fucking wrong. And it's almost, it's very funny. It's the duality of man. It's the Jungian thing. If you want to get back to full metal, full metal jacket here. But yes, under Frank's, was there a lie? If so, was that lie material? Or were they just so reckless that nobody should have relied upon that? That's where we're at.